start off with um, thanking Al, actually, for setting the stage, giving us all the enthusiasm and the inspiration that we need to um, continue on this journey, because we all know that sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's not so easy. And then I also want to thank all the presenters so far. Um, great ideas have come up. I've made lots of notes to really, um, because I think a lot of these ideas trigger other ideas, and I think together we're much stronger than always coming up with innovative ideas from our own team. So that is great. What we've done at Chilega Villages is we've taken these teams, safe environments, building relationships, um, making sure that we can understand each other, and we've developed modules, and we deliver those within each neighborhood to build a strong neighborhood team. The process of developing these modules and how they've been implemented, that's a whole other presentation, but I am going to talk a little bit about what has, what has been the outcome of some of that. So we've seen that some teams, and thanks to Jessica for these, <laughs> We've seen that our teams go from ordinary teams to extraordinary teams. Some teams start out as extraordinary, some teams start out as ordinary, but all are on a journey to become even more extraordinary. And I can tell you, we've had brainstorming sessions on how to call these teams. The team know and the team go, but that wasn't all that encouraging. <laughs> The team exceptional and the team okay, which was not all that great. So we stuck with ordinary and extraordinary. And as a person whose English is not my first language, I can tell you this is a little challenging. But Mr. Kent, I am trying the best I can. <laughs> so how do teams move from ordinary to extraordinary? Well, that's really what we want to know. So we collected a lot of different information. Some were stories and some were real hardcore measures that we normally collect in long-term care. And when team members from ordinary teams talked about what was happening on a day-to-day -day basis, they gave us these kind of quotes. They said, we have friendly interactions with other team members. We work as a team. We have good relationships with other team members. So you can see that these are strong statements and because of these team members being a bit schlegelized, they use the words relationships, team members, we are friendly with each other. But interestingly enough, when we compare that with extraordinary teams, we see different statements.